वेलकम टू इट्स टुमारो न्यूज आई एम हेना तलाटी मॉनसून टू गेन स्ट्रेंथ एस साइक्लोनिक स्टॉम वीकन्स इन इंडिया द इंडिया मेट्रोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट ऑन सैटरडे सेट कंडीशन आर बिकमिंग फेवरेबल फॉर फर्दर एडवांस ऑफ द साउथ वेस्ट मॉन्सून ओवर सम मोर पार्ट ऑफ साउथ पैनेंशुलर रीजन टिल जून ट्वेंटी सेकेंड The state is likely to see isolated heavy rainfall that is 7 to 11 cm from June 11th to 21st. A yellow alert has been issued for Patanthitta, Alappuzha, Kottayam, Ernakulam and Idukki on Sunday. SkyMet weather said with the cyclonic storm Biparjoy weakening and moving over Rajasthan, southwesterly winds will strengthen. over the southeast arabian sea leading to active monsoon conditions over the south peninsula this surge will help in further progression of the monsoon over the south peninsula thunderstorms will lightning accompanied by the gusty wind speed reaching to 30 to 40 km per hour is very likely to occur at one or two places in rajasthan The flood situation in Assam remained grim as the water levels continued to rise following incessant rains. The effect is very terrible and 10 districts are affected and over 37000 people are also under the deluge. Bishwanath, Darang, Dhemaji, Dibrugarh, Hojai, Lakhimpur, Nagaon, Sonitpur, Tinsukia and Udalguri are among the districts affected. by the first wave of floods this year meanwhile union minister has chaired a virtual meeting with the central and state agencies to review public health preparedness the highest 25275 people have been hit in upper assam's lakhimpur district followed by 38000 57 in dibrugarh and 3631 in bishwanath subdivision in the northern assam's sonitpur district all together 146 villages in assam have been impacted by floods due to the inundation caused by the rivers and breach of embankments three people were killed in landslides and one was swept away by the flood waters and is feared dead in assam and meghalaya in the last 24 hours even as the number of people affected by the deluge in assam is unclear cyclone bipajo has weakened into a deep depression and has moved over the southwest rajasthan its impact will be felt over the northern districts of the gujarat for another 24 hours after that the weather of gujarat may go dry rain activities may resume once again over the gujarat region by june 26th or 27th we can expect the onset of the monsoon over southern parts of the gujarat during that time that's all for now for more news updates stay tuned with us it's tomorrow news for more global weather updates like this subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates